On January 1, 1960, Sun City in Arizona opened its doors and became the first active adult community in the country. A reported 100,000 visitors came through the first three days alone to see what the developer behind Sun City, Del Webb, described as an active new way of life. A different kind of retirement community was envisioned, one where residents could pursue an active lifestyle with an abundance of social and recreational amenities and shape the community to their liking. It was built out in 1978 with a grand total of 27,000 homes and 43,000 residents. I think a lot of people um, have the wrong impression of a retirement community like Sun City. I think sometimes they feel like it's a place where you go to just to grow old, and that's not what Sun City is at all. It's not about growing old, it's about active aging. There certainly are still a lot of our older individuals here, but that is rapidly changing because the generations coming in are younger. They have a different viewpoint. They have different desires. I ride bikes with some guys that are in their 70s, but they're riding 60 mile bike rides. Sun City is nestled between Peoria and Surprise in the Arizona desert in a great location near extensive shopping and close to the highway. Just 15 minutes away from Glendale, home of the Cardinals football stadium and the Phoenix Coyotes hockey arena, and just 30 minutes from downtown Phoenix. Once completed, Sun City covered an area seven miles long and three miles wide, with main arteries running through, giving access to the community at numerous locations. The golf cart legal streets provide a convenient mode of transportation within a community that boasts one of the highest rates of golf holes per capita of any active adult community in the country, with eight golf courses and three private country clubs. Although Sun City has always been a favorite destination for golf enthusiasts, there are many exciting attractions for non-golfers as well. There are seven recreation centers, ranging from the original Oakmont Center to the new $20 million Fairway Center, at all, many amenities are available, including fitness centers, indoor and outdoor swimming pools, indoor walking track, tennis, and racquetball courts. In addition to the rec centers, Sun City is also home to 30 churches and synagogues and an amphitheater where free concerts are held for residents. Along with miles of trails around the two beautiful man-made fishing lakes or socializing with friends over a game of horseshoes, lawn bowling, or bocce ball. We like to bicycle, so we get a nice long bicycle in ride. We ride a tandem, so we get a long ride in on Saturday mornings. We like to hike, so we hit the mountains a little bit and hike on uh, Sundays. Uh, we dance a lot, so usually a Friday or Saturday night we're at a dance. And then comes Monday, we got to go back to work. <laughs> yeah, weekends are playtime, um, and, and we take full advantage of that. And there's lots to do out here to play, so it's a great thing. There's also an on-site hospital in Sun City, providing some of the best medical care in the region. What I like is to see people becoming involved, whether it's over here at all the different leather shops or the creative things that people can do, the artsy craftsy types of things, or here, dances, you go to a dance and there's a hundred, maybe a couple hundred people at a dance, so people are being active and I think that's great. In Sun City, there are more than 120 chartered clubs and interest groups, making it likely that every resident will find friends with similar interests. The community also hosts an amazing lineup of fun activities, from fitness classes and continuing education to parties and organized trips. While playing is perhaps the most important aspect of Sun City living, giving back has shaped the community from day one. There are dozens of organizations and volunteer boards that many residents are part of, from the posse who watch over the homes and neighborhoods, to Pride who pick up the streets, and the hospital which has over 800 volunteers. Well, Sun City is, is known as the, as the city of volunteers or the community of volunteers, and there are so many ways here to, to give back. If everyone only volunteered five hours a month wherever they lived, doing something positive for the community or giving back, 
there'd be an awful lot of things that could be accomplished. This is one of the places where people really do that. It impacted me on how clean it is around here. And I wanted to be part of that. I wanted to give back. And uh, so the Prides are about 350 people who volunteer. And we go out and we clean the medians, pick up trash and, and weed and paint the or orange tree trunks so they don't scald in the sun. That's one of the neat things here is that you can be as busy as you wish to be, as much as you wish or nothing at all. And so it, it gives you a lot of choices, much more so than when you're involved with your career and you're working 40, 60 plus hours a week and you don't even know who your neighbor is. So it's, it's a, quite a difference. Sun City has a great variety of homes built between 1960 and 1978. From cozy garden apartments to 3,000 square foot single family homes, there's something for everyone. One of the things that immediately struck us was that how the streets were wide, everything was clean, people were very friendly. It reminded you of, of uh, small town America in many ways and the fact that people were so friendly. It's absolutely the perfect place for us and we couldn't be happier. There's just so much to do, so many people to meet and, and uh, mm -hmm. we're, we're just thrilled. We firmly believe that, that our community is the best value in America. It's not just the home prices. For all of the recreational facilities we have, the low taxes, just the community and the people itself, uh, just make it an ideal situation as far as we're concerned. So we couldn't be happier. We think we made a great choice. Sun City is unique, a throwback to a more genteel time. While the rest of the world rushes about, the pace of life in Sun City is slower, the sense of togetherness greater, and the commitment to enjoy what we have almost limitless.